Here's another awesome older car that I had never posted up from 2019. This is a drag week car that was supposed to be a fairly unlimited, I believe, methanol only car. It has twin 94s. It's a big block. It is a big, big block. I can't remember how big. It has smart coils and Moran 550 some pound injectors. He eventually just decided to do pump ethanol with it. It has a 4L80E, imagine that. It's running on a Dominator. It has all the bells and whistles, CO2, everything you can imagine. And on a shakedown runs here, it easily produced almost 1500 rear wheel. So I can't find the logs that I had for this car, but on like extremely low single digit boost, it made 800 rear wheel. And I don't even think we got to 20 pounds and it was almost pinning my dyno. So yes, as you can see our progressions with the tune, <laughs> it's funny to see. Uh, this looks like a smaller chart, obviously. You could easily see this being a 300 horsepower to 6 or 800 horsepower SBE LS style build, but we're starting at 810 on, I think, wastegate, and then easily going to 1500 is the limit of my dyno, so we would have just started drawing flat lines, so I figured... He would be fine to start making passes with it from there on. I would love to see this car have some sort of air-to-air -air setup and 210-pound Bosch injectors. It would, it would definitely drive a lot nicer. And it would be cool to put this on Maple Grove's dyno, which reads like 2,000 or 2,500 horsepower and has a load cell. So it would be incredible to get what it can actually make. <laughs> 